is Victoria Rose here and today I'm really really excited because I'm doing something I've been wanting to do kind of like a long time something to do with cyberpunk 2077 it's coming out soon within next year we're jumping on it right now and we're gonna do an entire cyberpunk theme like the logo for cyberpunk there's like a theme makeup look and contacts and the whole works so I'm gonna take you guys along with this makeup look this is gonna be an intense makeover let's get started so I have a new hair doing my makeup I'll link her stuff below. She is in Japan and she does makeup. Sorry, I shouldn't put mascara on. I'm just like, oh, all right. Oh, she's just so little. Anyway, the eye area is gonna be black, so. Cool. Yeah, it's okay. Are uh, you wearing white? It might get stained. Are you okay with it? Um, I can change it to like a black top. I didn't think about that. I'm gonna change your black. So I didn't bring the right clothes, so she let me borrow some of her clothes because we want to do like a whole makeup look. I didn't realize how extensive this is going to be. So we're covering up the tattoo now. <laughs> we don't want to, but we have to. It'll be cool. So, we got the contacts, red contacts. You guys know how I am with putting in contacts. It's miserable. So we're gonna put them in before I put on my makeup because otherwise it's gonna, I'm gonna my tears are just gonna wash everything away. Don't make fun of me, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Have some trouble with them. Oh, you, don't, you haven't seen it yet. This takes me like half an hour. Oh my god, okay. Yeah, but really once you put in one eye, the other yeah, eye is more Yeah, I have more confidence. Yeah, yeah. Now you're looking too good. Please. How do you do it? You can try. I've never had someone try it for me before. I don't know how you do that with nails. I'm going to poke you. And make uh -uh. you blind. Oh, oh, <laughs> and make you blind. <laughs> and make you blind. I have full confidence. Disclaimer. After finally getting in contacts and we started on the makeup, she started with some special effects tricks and added tissues to glue onto my face to create some nice separation for the fire and robot look. These are the tusks we used to glue onto my face as well. If you're wondering what color might be the hardest to wash out, it's probably red. Okay, so we are setting the makeup now with baby powder. It's <laughs> gonna be a smart like baby. Look at that. That's so cool looking. This is when things started getting intense. My back started hurting. It's like three hours in right now, and it seems like it's never gonna end.
after some final touches and hairspray, we're finally done. Okay, so the makeup is all finished. We took some pictures and now we are going to actually go out like this on the train. This is gonna be really awkward and weird, especially because I think it's probably almost when everyone's getting off of work. So everyone's going to be staring and I will capture that for you. <laughs> Let's go out and go in public like this. Surprisingly, a lot of people didn't look, but it is Japan and cosplay is a common thing. But also, they're very sneaky when they look. I am in Kawasaki right now. We are going to a uh, cyberpunk themed arcade. I've been wanting to go here for a really long time. We're finally going to go there with my whole attire on. Not a lot of people are showing that they're staring very much. We're going to do a little cyberpunky shoot there, and I'll show you guys what the arcade looks like. I hear it's like super cool. And then, um, then I'm then I'm gonna take a 10 hour shower. This warehouse was so cool and I wish I could get more footage in it, but unfortunately you're not allowed to film. So this is some shaky footage of what I could get with my camera. I wanted some sort of stable footage, so I had Haptic go into the men's bathroom to film. The woman's bathroom wasn't nearly as cool. I mean, look at this. You're not allowed to film in there, but we- Don't discourage it, it sucks. <laughs> we, we snuck in though, and we got some shots of what it looks like on the inside, even though you're not allowed to go in there. Just for you guys as reference, you're not allowed to take pictures or videos or anything really, it's Japan. Well, being us, three seconds for the door. Yeah, we, we like... go in the door and she's like, no. I'm like. <laughs> I was like this. What? I They're don't like, understand you. I don't understand. Yeah, Japan doesn't like cosplay. Cosplayers to go anywhere. And I didn't consider myself a cosplayer, but I guess I'm dressed up, so. I think we pushed our luck. Because first they were like, uh, photos okay, no videos, no cosplayers. Yeah, and, and then, then they were like, like, no, no nothing. Yeah, it's like, you got <laughs> tusks, get out. <laughs> so. That's what we got in there. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And um, I'll show you how it goes, me taking this makeup off, because I'm nervous about taking it off. It took four hours to apply, so. At the arcade, we got hardcore yelled at right before, after I filmed that video. <laughs> She's like, delete it, delete all the video, and leave. <laughs> the thing is, is that other people are allowed to take pictures and videos on the DL. It's just if you're dressed up, you're not allowed to. So, 
we just kind of like snuck around and tried to film some stuff, but whatever. I'm gonna go and try and take all this makeup off. I'm gonna try to take a tusk off right now. Let's see if this e comes off easily. I'll update you guys what happens. Uh, oh, that one didn't come off as easy. Okay, my tusks are gone. So to get all this makeup off, I was told to use some sort of oil and soap. And let me tell you, I had to use a lot of oil and a lot of soap and it still all didn't come off. It was very, very hard to get this off. Make sure you like and subscribe and leave some comments for me to respond to. I love you guys very much. Stay extraterrestrial.